So I'm going to start out right away with this. What do you think we see on the screen? What would you diagnose from this code pattern? Plug wire is off. Bad plug wire. Okay, let's explain that word resistance. Okay, resistance is, we either have an open or we have a short, and anything in between is resistance. So resistance can be a variable from anywhere gray to black. So when we talk about resistance, as long as there's no current flow, resistance has no effect. I'm going to first, the first step would be the ignition test. I would disconnect everything on the coil and go directly to the, to the firebox, right? So now I'm going directly here to my spark gaps. Wide open, 22 kV, crank the engine over, and I know whether I do have a coil output. Okay, bingo, my whole test is done for coil output, every cylinder. All right, now I have to do it two times. First of all, I have to kill one side of the coil, okay, one side of the coil, and open up this and read this. Then I crank it over and I look at this one and do it uh, that way, two times. Now why two times? Because I want to see each side of the coil separate. I don't want to go from tower to tower. I want to go each side separate because I want to see if they, that coil is indeed doing the job when it comes to and ground. Now, if you have not much investment and you use this only once a month, it's paid for in three months. But on the other hand, if you have spent six or eight thousand dollars, you better use that every day, or at least enough to pay for itself in two or three years. You see, that is really the whole thing. If you understand how things work, it makes it so easy to also to do the diagnosis.